we we're shorthanded, but we can't use that as an excuse. I mean, we were shorthanded last game. We were short. We've been shorthanded since uh, the new year, I guess. I mean, we, we've already won a game shorthanded. Uh, we just got to play better, and everyone knows that. If if they don't, then they got to really uh, have a wake up call. We all got to get a wake up call if we think we're playing well. I don't really care how many people we got. We got to play way better. For at first, we were there, right there with them. And then we got a little fatigued. Some guys got tired. And once one guy gets tired, it kind of breaks down the whole defensive mindset uh, because of their offense. But um, they hit a lot of tough shots. I think um, I think at some points we did play some good defense on them. Um, we closed out. They just had some good shots and, and stepped up. And they got confident early against us. You know, we got off to a good start. It was kind of back and forth game. And then we go in a little bit of a rut offensively. And then they kept rolling. Uh, kind of a buzzsaw and, and we could just never dig ourselves out of a hole and again if they're shooting like that I think they're one of the best teams in our league and, and again they got the inside out presence with Knight the way he was able to score it early and then they spread you out so much so it's uh, it's a tough matchup for us uh, again it's it's something that we got to just be better on both ends of the floor and, and just dig in and get stops when we need to. Um, I thought we got a little out of sync offensively with not um, sharing the basketball and being efficient on that and we took some quick shots that led to early you know easy opportunities for them in transition and you know again with it with a younger group of guys are trying to figure it out and, and we got to continue to stay positive and we have a short-term memory in this league you know we get a chance to come back and compete at two o'clock against a really good UNC Wilmington team uh, it's going to be a lot harder than it was uh, last Saturday down there so we got to try to bounce back and regroup tomorrow and work on a couple things be ready to compete again.